so the way i look at it uh, i think what magazines allow you to do is to uh, you know set a shared agenda with the customer because uh, unlike you know uh, for compared to other sort of forms unlike uh, television which is great at storytelling or uh, the the tv med- uh, sorry the newspaper medium which is more about communicating facts and figures what uh, magazines allow you to do is to provide in depth perspectives which i think uh, in today's world is something that a lot of uh, you know customers look for to in order to form their opinions i think we we give magazines a very considered opinion because uh, you know as a brand uh, we don't go for brand visibility we go for brand relevance and one of the things that you need to do while building brand relevance is to actually uh, you know set up a shared agenda with the customer forge a shared belief and and we see magazines you know playing a very important role in actually doing that job uh, and 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 secondly uh, it's not just about setting an agenda it's about also about you know making the right case using evidence and facts and again we see uh, you know magazines being able to very clearly articulate uh, you know that piece of the communication so 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 i think uh, they have a very strong place and and as we've seen today uh, it's not just the physical form i think magazine brands have also evolved uh, into having a, a, a digital form they've also evolved into being events and so on and so forth so what magazines also today do for the customer is give a very strong 360 degree experience so i think a combination of all of this ensures that they have a strong role to play in your media plans absolutely uh, correct because if you look at what builds brands today uh, that clearly two factors of authenticity and advocacy right and and these aren't stuff that you would really measure in very you know stringent quantitative terms these are more matters uh, where qualitative feels like engagement like interactivity like trust etc play a very strong role and and therefore um, as much as you would evaluate a magazine for the audience it gives you would also look at it in terms of what it actually delivers in terms of impact so absolutely you would look at those factors so digital is more than just a medium i think digital is a whole culture right the way you look at Uh, digital happening i mean it's shaping the way you and me uh, consume information today if you want to know something about uh, anything you would go and google it right uh, you would trust the information that you see there you would research you know products online so for example if you want to go and buy a new cell phone tomorrow you actually go and read those reviews or if you want to go and buy a new car you're going to go and read those reviews similarly uh, you know uh, a phenomenon like facebook is actually redefining how people do relationships so digital is more than just a medium digital is actually more a culture it's becoming a way of life it's becoming a way of life where uh, you know you believe in interactivity you're believing in expressing yourself uh, you're believing in communities uh, and you're believing in collaboration and so on and so forth and i think when you look at magazines uh, whether it's a physical form or the magazine brand right uh, what you would see are these the, the good magazines and the great magazines are actually evolving to make uh, sort of use uh, and leverage the power of digital and and that is what i really see as a way forward